Morning, Steve here in Chicago with Morning Grain Comments. Well, it's Friday. It's been an interesting week. For the week, wheat prices are anywhere from 3 to 24 cents lower. Corn down 14 cents. Beans down 8. Meals down $9 a ton. And soybean oil is up 65 points. I think that uh, in the meal-oil relationship, domestically, meal demand continues to be less than what the market is expecting. Meal basis continues to be weak and actually below delivery values. So we'll see, you know, if there's any deliveries on the May contract when we get to the first notice day. On the oil side, you've got a couple of things working in favor of U.S. oil. First of all, you got the producer credit that is uh, suggesting that no longer will imported oil like palm oil or soybean oil from Argentina will be allowed to have this credit, which probably will stop exports. There's also a dumping rule against Argentina and uh, Malaysian oil that could stop their imports. So um, that pushes a higher mandated soybean oil uh, biofuel to soybean oil, which could help soybean oil prices as far as uh, crushing capacity. National Weather Service came out yesterday with a three-month outlook, and the bottom line is it's going to be a warm summer. It doesn't really show too much as far as precip is concerned, that famous equal chance of warmer and drier over much of the Midwest. So they're not really taking a stand. A little bit of drier around the Great Lakes and wetness across the uh, Rockies. So we'll just have to see how the, all that unfolds. The trade will be watching planning progress over the next four days before rain start in the Midwest on Tuesday. Six to ten day has it <clears throat> warm in the east, cool in the west, and pretty much wet across much of the Midwest. And the rains will start next Tuesday, and it looks like they'll be mostly around the southern half of the Midwest where the heaviest rains are going to be. So we'll see how much corn gets planted in the market. Uh, is a weather market now. As far as the uh, funds, they were selling our beans, meal, corn, and wheat yesterday buyers a little bit of oil. We continue to see liquidation of the May open interest. Overall, open interest was up corn pretty dramatically. 22,000 contracts yesterday, 16,000 in wheat. So it suggests, especially with Kansas City making new contract lows, that they're adding to their already record short positions in, in wheat and close to a sh record short position in corn. Open interest in beans actually went down a little bit. So um, again, we're, we're getting out the, the week longs in the bean market. Uh, as we look at a big South American crop and U.S. farmers possibly increasing acres. So again, uh, we're on the defensive as far as the grains are concerned. And if we combine all the grains, funds, managed funds are a record short position. As always, these are my thoughts and not those of ADM or ADM Investor Services and have a safe and profitable trading day.